television dude and Hunter and we went garage sailing. We found a we, we went to one sale. One sale. We have all a bunch of cool books and some board games we picked up. Uh, so some of it's video game related. Stuff. Yeah, yeah. Rand Rand McNally vacation destination. I, I I didn't realize who Rand McNally was at first till the lady said he was the guy that yeah, does, does the maps. maps. I knew that. Cool. Cool. Yeah. They looked like they had all the pieces. Pathfinder. Which looks cool. These were a dollar piece. Yeah, it looks like a cool game, actually. Pathfinder looks cool. Two-player tracking game. Yeah, it seems fun. The yeah. back sound made it sound fun. And, uh... I don't know what this is. Any card can be a winner. The trumpet game. I'm not sure... The longer sure. you play, the faster it changes. The fun never stops. I'm not sure what this is, but I looked it up, and I think it's an 80s game. Really? I think it's an 80s board game. I'm super excited for this. Electronics game. I finally get an issue of this. I've been wanting some issues of this forever. They're just not cheap. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. I, I have to go through a few pages before we move on. It goes over a lot of the Commodore. Should even have a television in here. When? Yeah. Cl oh, the Waco Command Stick. Yeah. Cool. Mr. Pinball dies. Harry Williams, founder of Williams Electronics, died. Really? September 11th, 1983. Really? Arcade ace Tony Snyder, last seen setting two world records. One for the highest score on Qbert, and and one for longest time playing an arcade video game, which is 57 hours, Jesus. 12 minutes, 18 seconds. Good God. Cool. Software beat. I, I I should I could do a whole video on this this magazine here. Yeah, really. I should uh, get through it. Fire command. Big stakeout. This is cool. Clean Sorry, Vision 50, versus fifty two hundred. So when television's being left, I'm not showing this very well, am I? I'm not look. I can't see yeah. behind me. You're not helping. I'm reading the magazine. It's cool. I've never seen any issues of uh yeah, I've been wanting kind of games. I have I have them in PDF form. But you wanted the actual magazine. Yeah. Video gaming scramble. Don't know if they have to even talk about it in television this issue. But I'm going kinda of fast. You know. You get around to reading it at some point. Oh the challenge of Zork. Challenge of Zork. Zork two, Zork yeah. three. Cool. PC games, I guess. Furniture for gamers. <laughs> hey, that's pretty cool. Keep your experience, expensive gaming system safe from harm. Video game, game dentistry? Probably talks about those Atari games. Yeah, but it, yeah, it does. Flag attack and stuff? Mm -hmm. Probably. Computers go to war. Computers go to war. I know there are some issues of this that really talk about the Intellivision. Do they? But this, I don't know if this is one of those issues. I have to go back and read more detail in the beginning and stuff. It's a safe cracker. Yeah. Television Aries. Hey. Television Aries. It says in Television Aries. Television Aries. With a yen for adventure. We'll find plenty to sink their teeth into with Safe Cracker. A Magic's two screen spy thriller. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I didn't know they ever referred to him as in Television Aries. There's Fathom for the. Uh, Fathom for the in Television. Yeah. Cool. So Fathom, it is. it is uh, mentioned. Atari stuff though, Nightmare Joust, oh. Centipede 5200. This is my big excitement. Oh, Atari area. for us. You don't even know what's in the rest of that box. No, we haven't looked. We looked a little. We looked a little. Oh, that's uh, television baseball. Yeah, it's in television baseball. Play 20 questions with microcomputer medic. What's the uh, television question? I don't feel like reading all this right now. If companies such as Coleco, Atari, and Mattel can make noises come out of cartridges without any adapter, why can't they make then why can't they make a word or even a sentence come out without a speech voice module? There are plenty of technical reasons why the existing systems are incapable of assimilating the human voice. Mattel's and television did, did in fact, offer a barely discernible you're out 
in the, their Major League Baseball, but the clumsy articulation is the most obvious answer to your question. There is a world of difference between noises and speech. Just, Just ask. ask any cat. <laughs> but ask a doctor in all seriousness. Bleeps and bloops require a lot less from micro microprocessor than imitation of highly evolved and sophisticated human voice capability. The computer needs to actually store within its memory banks the, all the possible sounds that can be assembled and reassembled to form world, words. And that and all, that involves a lot of memory. That's cool. That is cool. Oh, uh, Donkey Kong? Donkey Kong 2. Donkey Kong 2? For Nintendo. LCD game? Uh... Yeah, I think so. I see LCD in there a couple times. I don't feel like it's a lot of reading to find out. Yeah. Space Invaders. Oh, we're missing something a little, here. A little torn. Hopefully that's, that's from an, hopefully that's from another magazine. Well, the back here is tore up a little bit. Unfortunately. Oh, yeah. Unfortunately. Yeah. But we hardly paid anything for this at all. So still really cool. And we should we should go through that at some point. We're going through it right now. This box. Yeah, a whole box of books. Uh, Let's start with this stuff. Yeah. There was some Ripley's Believe It or Not books. There's even more in there. I love Ripley's Believe It or Not oh, stuff. Uh, oh, still like that. There you go. Yeah, there we go. I wonder they, what they were they, seeing the whole time. I, I, they could see the magazine. Got two Ripley's Believe It or Not books. Those are cool. There could be more in there. Yeah, I think there are more. I saw a couple more. Uh, I want this for myself. H.G. Wells, The Time Machine. That's a great book. Yeah. I've read that before. That's I love the movie. I haven't seen the movie. Concrete Masonry. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, like it's old. Uh, I guess, like, It's yeah. almost like old 50s deco stuff. Yeah. Like that right there. That's actually pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And an engineer. engineer's mini notebook. 555 timer IC circuits. Oh, it's from Radio Shack. Radio Shack. I wonder if that's worth anything. Cool. Okay. Big box of books. That was a book I had before, I think, but we'll show it anyway. Charity and Power. Charity and Power. Early. Start pulling these out. We don't got much time. We gotta hurry. Oh, we have all the time in the yeah. world. Some magazine there. Uh, oh, oh. What? I hope I didn't show that. What is it? There was nudity in there. Oh, was it? Yeah. <laughs> what is that? Is it missing the front cover? Yeah, it's missing the front cover. Oh, wait a minute. It's Cosmopolitan, 1974. They had nudity in Cosmopolitan? Yeah, did Cosmopolitan have nudity? It says 1974. That's interesting. And Cosmoto Cosmopolitan. Got a uh, General Electric's transistor manual. What kind of luck is that? Yeah, really, that's interesting. Transistor manual. <laughs> oh, everybody's believe it or not. Oh. Uh, Above and Beyond Encyclopedia of Aviation and Space Science. Look at those transistors. Yeah. Uh, oh, Guinness Book of World Records, 1980. Yeah. I have a few of these. 1980. That's incredible. Oh, yeah, I wanted that one, too. I used to watch this show all the time when I was younger. Isaac Asimov, a weef of death. Oh, uh, this guy is a master of the uh, science fiction. Is you it? see his name a lot when you look up science fiction. Uh, the oscillator at work. Not too sure what an oscillator is. Really? Yeah. Oh, more more electronic more, stuff. Might be more electronic stuff. Yeah. Ooh, tube substitution. Lots of sciencey stuff in there. Yeah, this is cool stuff. Oh, a sleeve for a forty-five. The Warrior. Oh, I wish that was in there. Oh, fuck. Maybe the record's fit? in the box. Doubt it. The Great International Math on Keys. What is that? I guess basic math, some sort of mathematics. Interesting. This is some cool shit. Yeah. Scale model railroading. Now that's cool. That one is cool. It said it had pictures and stuff of like. Model railroads, I guess. Yeah, there's some. Cool. I kind of want that. Assignment in Eternity. Uh. 101 Easy Ham Radio Projects. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, that's very really cool. Oh, these were cool. I asked if they had the uh, computer. Oh, the... Uh... Oh, yeah. What, what, 
We'll do that right so, now. Yeah, okay. So this is in the box. We don't know what it is. It just says, This is Paul, and it's sealed like a birthday card. It's a blank envelope. And it could be a birthday card. Or it could be top secret. Never open birthday yeah. card. Didn't you tell the lady, too? Yeah, and she didn't care. She, she said, maybe there's money inside. And then didn't. It is a birthday card. Money, 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 money. Yeah. Come on. No money. No money. Just say, mom and pa. Okay. Or mom and pops. Okay. We were banking that there could be some money in that. Okay, these were kind of cool. Oh, it's an Easter card. It's not a birthday oh, card. Oh, it's Easter. Special e Easter wish. Asked if they had the computer, but we got some personal computing for the VIC-20, which I've had these books before, both of these. I want a Commodore 64. I had a VIC-20 at one point, and that was pretty cool. This is getting a little uh, unraveled there. Yeah. Yeah. Pulse and switching circuits. Cool. Oh, the Family Handyman's Book of Kitchen Ideas. Maybe we can use that for the stove. Yeah, right. Oh, yeah. Eyewitness History of World War II Siege. Ooh. That's cool. That oh, it's got pictures? Yeah. Oh. That could be really interesting, too. Oh, another one. Victory. Victory. Oh, Planet of the Apes? Yeah. Cool. There's some cool shit in there. Oh, got another one. Counterattack. I wonder if this is like a whole series. Maybe. Science fiction adventure. Lester Del Rey. Rocket Jockey. Cool. Looks interesting. Thrice Upon a Time. I think I've heard that. It's got a cool fucking, like, Commodore computer. Yeah. I think that's a Commodore computer, an early one. Well, it says, uh... Does it say Commodore? It doesn't say anything. I think it's just made to look like one. Cool. You got, uh, Robert Silverberg, Those Who Watch, author of Lord Valentine's Castle. Uh, there are a whole bunch of these papers in here. I don't know what any of this stuff is. It looks like drawings for electronics. Like, look, that looks like designs and stuff. Yeah, that's... We got rare blueprints. Rare blueprints. Oh, we have some more. It's all, like, equations. Maybe schoolwork. Yeah, my, I think it is schoolwork, because that was, like, a Scantron and stuff. But, yeah. What is that? Transfer project? Transfer project. Some sort of science project. Interesting. Yeah, graduation September 1984. Is that what that is? Yeah. Cool. Circuit Breaker. This was probably their, uh... I bet that was, like... Oh, the, the National uh, Education Center. It's probably their, like, little thing. Yeah, okay. Why do these have different offers? Offers the uh, same thing. Okay, well, we got two of these electron... Oh, electricity and electronics principles. That's probably when you, what he went to and school applications. for. Yeah, I bet he went for... Like, Whoever and, had these books. Maybe that's why it's all engineering books. Yeah. But lots of cool stuff. Uh, Robert A. Heinlein, Beyond This Horizon. Ooh, what's that? Mind linking. Some sort of magazine? Oh, let's take a look at that. Yeah, let's see what we got going on there. Mind linking. Can you be bribed? Cool, it's like old computers. TV SWAT Meat Plus. Wireless TV Merge Saver. Fax Basher. The Inkjet Solution. Rip-off artists. PC Soul Snatcher. The early PCs. Yeah, this is cool, too. Competition Crusher. Fuck, I want all these. Thunderbox. Oh, yeah. Look at stereo. Oh, I gotta have this one. I'll talk Wait, about I'll CDs. Give you the, the World War II books. You want that? Yeah, okay. Oh, we got more magazines. Got a bunch of them here. We got a... Uh, Eora Electronics. $79 Audio File Remote CD Player Catch. Cool. We got a bunch of these. Uh, that's winter of 89 for that one. Could be cool electronics in there. February of 89 for Global Computer Supplies. Oh, this is supplies. Uh, something about test engines. I don't think that's anything. Yeah, another supplies. Volume 20. Oh, this is like, uh, is this like, uh, it's like a buyer's computers? catalog, yeah. man. Cool. Okay, we'll have to go through all these. Yeah. Uh, volume 20, 4,000 items for Microsoft DOS computers. This is 1989. Yeah, this one's. 89 computers. This is products for Macintosh and DOS. Uh, we got a year on it. 
Got to be 80s, I'm sure. Let's see. Because it mentions, uh, well, I missed Dawson. It says Dawson Macintosh. Yeah, could be around the same year. Probably 80s, late 80s. Cool. Got the, uh... You can order some old, yeah. out-of-date processors. Yeah, get some modems. Cool. It's got a CompuAd, third anniversary catalog, another one of these. Whoever owned this box was really into the computers. See if it was a date. They lived in Michigan. Did they? That's gonna tell us the address on. Oh shit! Popular Science magazines. Oh. What's coming in the '69 car? It's Buyer's Guide to Home Air Conditioners. <laughs> oh, this one's kind of got tore up, but uh. Can atomic scientists ban the bomb? Oh, this is December of '68. These are old ones. Wow. I wonder if these got any value. Bobby's gonna go ape shit if he sees these. This one's torn. Yeah, these are all like falling apart, but that first one was okay. They might, they might all go together. Yeah. Products to service electronic equipment, power and hand there? tools. Ooh, there's still more stuff in there. Yeah. Special Detroit. Oh, is this a Sears catalog? Yeah. yeah. One ninety two. Yeah. See, if, oh, this is just uh, tools. power tools though. No video games. No. Uh, but here we got something awesome. Popular Science Special Detroit Preview Auto Tech of ninety two. Yeah, no electronics. No toys. This is cool, talking about all the cars of the 90s. Oh, it's got a computer ad in it. No other training shows you how to troubleshoot and service computers like NRI. Cool. All calendars. 1991 hey, collection. A, a train calendar? Is that what that is? Is this four wheeling? Four by four? Oh, no, this is a catalog to buy calendars. Uh, this is a four by four magazine. Huh, got, another, got another one, Peterson's four four wheel. So he went from being the nerd in the eighties to off wheeling in the nineties. Is this nineties? Yeah, I'm sure it is. Ninety two. Oh, more popular science stuff. Popular science buckyball, magic molecule for new materials. MCM electronics for the summer of ninety one. I saw on the bag it's got ad for like uh, minor camcorder repair tapes. Cool. Oh man, we got a bunch of these four wheel magazines. I think those might be worth something. Peterson's four wheel, popular science man powered subs, popular science wild weasels, a uh, different four wheeler magazine. Oh, another one of those engineers' mini notebooks. Op amp IC circuits. Peterson's four wheel. Oh, there's a box of them. What's that? Sears catalog. It's a whole sealed bag. Oh, no way. What's this? What else is in there? Are we towards the end? Oh, we got another envelope here. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, nutty. Nutty? Oh, let's do this Is right that a now. sealed bag of Sears catalogs? Maybe. Gold mine. Yeah. Gold. gold, Jerry. Gold. Money. 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 No, probably not. This guy never got some money. Yeah. Ooh, snakes and lizards. Oh, you I can, love yeah, yeah. I love reptiles. There's probably nothing in here. Just probably talking. It said for young readers. Young readers. But cool. I, I like it anyway. Cool. I like how they make the snake look so evil. Oh, we got something else here. Paul and Mary. Oh, so Peter Paul, Paul and, and Mary. Mary. Yeah, Peter Paul and Mary. You gonna you gonna open that one? Yeah. <laughs> Is that sealed too? Yeah, presenting. Oh, somebody's oh. kid. What oh. year is this Sears catalog? Oh, hey, another World War II book. And the Green Hills of Earth. There's uh, the, the. Oh, the uh, catalog rapid refund form. Sealed hey. again. Inside of that seal, there's another seal. Man, you might. Sealed have, inside of here. Maybe you just hit the gold mine. Maybe you're buying those boxes. I think it's just one catalog. Oh, okay. One of their big catalogs. Oh, we got another thing here. From oh. Miss and Mrs. That one, I don't think that one's sealed, is it? From Michigan, though. Money's probably already gone. <laughs> Money's already gone. Money. No. As a grandson. Somebody's grandson. <laughs> We're missing out on money. Oh. A dictionary. That's what we need. We can open this beast up. That's a big ass cat. It's worth more sealed. Yeah. 
You had like the whole sealed bag. This is right from the 90s. Uh, now there's something on top of that. A band, paper band. I wish I could slide it off so I don't ruin the band. Painting, painting, paneling, and wallpapering. Paper band around it. Easy to make furniture, but it won't come off. Oh, there we go. Hey, how to make bookshelves and cabinets. Uh, Ford ham. Oh, there you go. The Wonders of Nature. Oh, it's a 1994 catalog. Eh. Eh. There you go, the Wonders of Nature. Child introduction to the world of animals, planets, bird, plants, birds, fish, oh, and insects. Oh, open that. On camera there. Talking about giraffes and zebras. Let's see what kind of. If I can find the toys and electronics in this. Falcon, one. carrier pigeon. Seals, turtles, that's cool. That might have been just about everything. I can find any toys. Well, whatever this is. Oh, shit. Is this in here? What? National Geographic Space Kit. Ooh. It is? Oh, hell yeah. How to assemble and use your space scope. It's a make your own, like, telescope. That's badass. Where's the toys in this thing? I know I'm not on that issue. Uh, probably not. Just no one my lock. Yeah, just because you want it. Yeah. Doesn't mean you get anything. No index or anything. Oh, hey. Some sealed uh, electronics card pack. What is that? I don't know. Got a bunch of random mail in here. Electronics card pack? Open it up. Okay. Oh, another Big 20 thing. What is that? Big 20 schematics? We got the blueprint for a Big 20 here? Can I make my own? <laughs> main logic. Show, show, show that. Yeah. Big 20 schematic. Main. It looks like it came out of the book. I bet it was in that re programmer's guide. I can't find no toys in here. All I find is the. Uh, I find some electronics, more like video cameras and stuff. Let's uh, see if I can open this. Magazine one. smells. Well, yeah, it's been sitting in this box probably for. Damn near 20 years. For all these magazines smell. Damn it, I wanted to see some toys. Can't get this fucking card back open. 94, at least you could have seen a. Uh, Genesis or. Yeah. I'm gonna look again. On the back this time. There's the TVs, camcorders. There we go. I found it. Sure is a card pack, like a uh, cordless four in one soldering tool, okay. licensed technician, teeth kit, world's smallest digital panel meters and counters. Cool. Okay, move that space kit, and I'll put this, and move that so we don't ruin it. And I'll, move, I'll put this right here. Found the, uh, oh, it's the NES. We got some, uh, I got, got an NES for $89.99. Game Boy for seventy nine ninety nine. I can't hold shit back together. You can get, make, you can get Mega Man three. Really? For how much is it? Thirty bucks. Yeah, I wish we could get that now. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, it does smell. Yeah, <laughs> it is this book, isn't it? Yeah. Let's put this in a box with a fabric softener. Or yeah. Super Nintendo for ninety nine ninety nine. It's only ten bucks Street, more. Street Fighter Two was sixty eight dollars. Funny, this is only ten bucks more than an NES. So why wouldn't you buy that? Right. Street Fighter Two was sixty eight dollars. Jeez. The Turtles in Time for fifty three ninety nine. You telling me Street Fighter Two is worth more than Turtles in Time? Come on. We got the Game Gear. We have the the uh, the Super the, the Sega, Sega Super, Super CD, CD. for three hundred dollars. Is that what they called it when it first maybe, came out? Maybe. Super, Sega Super CD. Oh, there's a bug crawling down the box. Oh, yeah, there sure is. Kill that thing. Some kind of like a moth uh, yeah. fly thing. Ooh, Genesis was only $100. I don't know moth fly things in my house. Oh, Golden Axe. Talking about Golden Axe. Super CD is a Super CD drive that connects to your Sega Genesis to bring you a whole new dimension of gaming experience. You'll be able to play all your Genesis cartridges and also all the games will be available in the new CD-ROM format with over 500 times the capacity of a high-powered 8 meg cartridges. Cartridge games will feature CD quality, stereo sound, motion video, and incredible graphics and animation. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But they also, thought. also be uh, because the Sega 
Super CD is high quality auto CD player with the ability to play all your audio CDs through any stereo equipped CD input ports. Sega Genesis is not included. Steps right on top of the Sega Super CD. I'm glad they changed it. Yeah. Sega CD. Sega Super Super Sega CD. Using or... a con convenient docking module. Two channel stereo output with eight times over sampling. It even comes with a great CD software packed in with CD ROM game packs. One CD sam one CD audio sampler, one CD graphics sampler. Cool. Halo Sonic 2 is forty seven dollars. Let's see the included CD software. Pack one, Golden Axe, Street Rage, mm -hmm. Tory Columns, CD Pack Two, Sherlock Holmes, Soul Feast. We have the audio sampler, Rock and Roll audio sampler, featuring top artists such as Wolfgang Press and Sister Double Happiness. Who's that? <laughs> CD graphics sampler includes top artists such as Fleetwood Mac, Jimi Hendrix, and Chris Isaac. I don't know who Chris Isaac is. Night Trap. Something is happening in Martin's place. Your mission is to protect the beautiful female house guests. First CD title with continuous full motion audio and video. Cobra Command. Marky Mark and the Funky Bunch. Oh, yeah, there you Everyone go. Everyone with music video using footage from Marky Mark videos. Using special effects and save it on a VCR when you're done. <laughs> <laughs> Three songs from Marky Mark. Amazing. It's amazing. What's over here? Genesis. The Genesis. Yeah, Sonic 2 is $47. Jeez. Uh, what else they got? Streets of Rage 2. John Madden 93. John Madden 93 was more than Sonic 2. I believe 2. it was around December, November, December. It was in the, it was in the, Man. it was snow on the ground when I went to get my Sega Genesis. Really? Yeah. So it was around there. Cause I, my, my first magazines were like December of 93 yeah. in the 94. Well, I guess that's everything. All kinds of electronics. Science fiction. Uh, yeah. Nature. Video games. Board games. We're going on to 27 minutes here. Jesus. That's a lot of cool stuff there. That is a lot of cool stuff. And we paid... 10 bucks for the box of books and a dollar piece for the board game. So 13 bucks For all that. I think that's pretty good. Yeah, I think that was pretty good. So, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, thanks for watching.